Yet using dogs to assist the military is far from new, with accounts of dogs being used for such purposes going back as far as 600 BC to a battle in ancient Greece between the Aleuts, King of Lydia, and the Sumerians. Over the centuries, military working dogs have been used in many different roles, including as attack dogs, communication dogs, sentries, mascots, detection and tracking dogs, and controversially, for medical research. Contemporary military working dogs are often deployed as guard dogs for drug and explosive detection, as patrol dogs, and in military law enforcement roles. In this episode, we've listed the top 10 military working dog breeds. Number 10. English Mastiff The Mastiff is an exceptionally old breed, and their ancestors likely were some of the first dogs ever used in war. Mastiffs were known to have been used as attack dogs by both ancient Roman and Greek armies who fitted their dogs with heavy spiked armor and sent them into battle ahead of the troops to attack the enemy. Today, Mastiffs are not typically used as military dogs, yet the tactic of letting a dog loose to chase down and attack an enemy has been adapted to the modern battlefield and is used by certain special forces troops as a method of subduing and capturing an enemy combatant. Number 9. Labrador Retriever During the Vietnam War, Labrador Retrievers were the U.S. military's first choice of dog when it came to combat training. In this task, Labradors were teamed up with four or five combat troops and sent deep into the jungle to rescue injured troops and find downed airmen. It was a task that the Labrador excelled in, and many American service members owe their lives to the keen noses of those Labrador Retrievers. Today, Labradors are still used by the military, and they've served with distinction in both Iraq and Afghanistan as explosive detector dogs. Number 8. Airedale Terrier Though no longer used as a military working dog, the Airedale Terrier was one of the most common breeds used by the British military in World War I. These tough and loyal dogs were trained as communication dogs and were tasked with carrying messages back and forth across the battlefield. They did this by being trained to work with two handlers, one of whom would be sent to the front lines and the other remained behind in the command position. When a message needed to be sent, it was attached to the dog's collar and carried to the second handler by the Airedale Terrier. These dogs were renowned for their ability to stay low and out of sight, their speed and their devotion to duty. In the days before reliable mobile radio, they were an essential component of the British military's command and communication system. Number 7. Boxer Smart, independent, and playful, boxers were once a go-to dog when the military needed a communications dog. Much like the Airedale Terrier, the boxer was trained to work with two handlers, running messages back and forth across the battlefield in the days before reliable mobile radio communications. The boxer has also been used in military search and rescue roles and as explosive detector dogs. Number 6. Giant Schnauzer once a virtually unknown breed outside of Bavaria, the giant schnauzer was originally bred as a farm dog, but gained popularity as a military dog during World War I and World War II. Somewhat inexplicably after World War II, giant schnauzers were not used for military service until 1980 when the U.S. Air Force introduced them again as bomb detection dogs. While still not a popular breed of working dog, a U.S. Air Force giant schnauzer named Brock was part of President Trump's security detail during his trip to Hamburg for the G20 summit. Number 5. Rottweiler Loyal, strong, and obedient, it's little wonder that Rottweilers were used to great effect by the U.S. military during both World War I and World War II as messengers and guard dogs. Employed in much the same way as other messenger dogs, Rottweilers were often tasked with carrying important messages from the front lines and in that way, they had a huge impact on the success of many military operations and battles. Number 4. Doberman Pinscher The lovable Doberman Pinscher is another large and easily trainable dog that has seen considerable service as a military working dog. Over the years, the Doberman has served with the U.S. military in both World War I and World War II. Although employed mainly as guard dogs, Dobermans were also trained to find and rescue wounded soldiers to act as messengers, and to be patrol dogs employed to detect enemy locations and mines. The Doberman has fallen out of favor as a military dog in modern times as they're not suited to all weather conditions as the following breeds are. 
Number 3. German Shepherd The German Shepherd is by far the most common dog found in military service. Highly intelligent, strong, agile, and easy to train, these large dogs are naturally moderately aggressive but are highly protective and can certainly ramp up the aggression when required. Importantly, they're also able to adapt to almost any climactic condition. While some other dog breeds exhibit many of these traits, none exhibit all of them as consistently as the German Shepherd. Number 2. Belgian Malinois The Belgian Malinois is one of four varieties of Belgian Shepherds and one of the most popular dogs used by the military today. At first glance, they have a similar look to their close relative, the German Shepherd, and like them are brave, loyal, and highly intelligent dogs. The Belgian Malinois is a slightly smaller dog than the German Shepherd, making them more suitable for traveling in military vehicles and parachuting or rappelling into operational areas with their handlers. The Belgian Malinois is also highly regarded for their exceptionally quick reaction time, fearless dedication to duty, and strong protective instinct. Number 1. Dutch Shepherd Dutch Shepherds are growing in popularity as a military service dog and together with the German Shepherd and Belgian Malinois round out the top three dog breeds currently used by the U.S. military. Dutch Shepherds are similar in size and appearance to the German Shepherd and are often mistaken for the more popular breed. Yet they're an individual breed and these hardworking, loyal, and extremely active dogs are making a name of themselves as both general patrol and explosive detection dogs. So that was it. I really hope you enjoyed our video. Now a question. What would you name this little soldier? Let us know in the comments. Here are some other cool videos I know you'll enjoy. See you guys later.